What up, it's your boy Lil C's back in another YouTube vid uh, reaction video, and uh, this reaction is people call someone to say sorry. So this one seems really intense, very emotional. I hope you guys got a cigarette ready, and you know the drill. And let's react. I'm sorry. I treated you really badly after the divorce, and I don't think I ever apologized. <laughs> Call someone and say, I'm sorry. Oh, shoot. Oh, fuck. This isn't nice at all. I don't know who I would need to apologize to. You I'm a good of, person. Is there someone that you've heard? It looks like I've, I've heard of a lot of people, <laughs> unintentionally. But I think I'm going to call my dad. When we butt heads, we butt heads hard. Hey, Dad. So you remember last time we got into an argument, I was kind of a butt head to you? Um, which time? <laughs> I was really just calling to say that I apologize. I know that I can use my words in a lot better ways. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm gonna call my ex-girlfriend and apologize for not telling her I was gay. Hello. Hey Maddie, I just want to apologize for never letting you know that I was gay while I was with you. But I know that you were dating me in high school and everyone was telling you that you were dating a gay dude. I feel like that would have been hard for you and I feel like I should have just been honest with you sooner. Nothing to worry about. I love you. I love you Mwah. Who's someone that you think needs to hear I'm sorry? I'll call my sister. I'm gonna call my sister. Maybe my sister? She has been sacrificing all of her free time to go to the hospital and see my dad. Hello? Hey, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. You show so much strength in everything that you're doing lately by going to the hospital and seeing Deity. Thank you for saying that. I know that it's hard for you to go to the hospital, but thank you for taking care of everybody at home. I really don't know where I'd be without you. I just wanted to call and apologize because I feel like I haven't really been there for you. And I know that it's been a hard time with you like transitioning into high school. You don't have to apologize. I totally understand because I know you're super busy with everything you've got going on. I love you. I love you too. Bye. Okay, bye. Why'd that make you emotional? I just don't get to see them as often as I'd like to. <coughs> Hello? I wanted to say I'm sorry for not paying you back for the weed. <laughs> I looks like such a fuck, nigga, bruh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, um, I'll give it. I'll, I'll pay you back. The person I was thinking of apologizing to was actually one of my exes because I kind of left him at a sensitive time in his life. Hi, Maddie. Hi. I'm so sorry that I wasn't better to you. They were, uh, it was pretty rough, but no, I, I'm i seriously glad that I'm still friends with you and your apology is not necessary, honestly. Who do you think would really appreciate hearing an apology from you? My mom. We had all planned to go to my mom's house for the holidays, but there was drama and, oh, she's FaceTiming me. Oh Talk God. Okay. Cry? No, I'm not gonna cry. Am I gonna cry? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not, I don't wanna cry. I don't. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Mom. Hi, honey. I just wanted to say that I'm sorry. I treated you really badly after the divorce. And I don't think I ever apologized for the things that I said. And I know that everything that's happening, we'll get through it. I'm so sorry. I know that you were there. You would have made everyone smile because you're the fixer. <sighs> It was hard on everybody, and I know I didn't handle things well either, but I really appreciate the apology, and I'm sorry too. I love you. <laughs> I'm proud of you. My mom has like never told me I'm sorry. I'm like shaking. Who's someone that would appreciate hearing you apologize? My friend Ashley. She went through something that wasn't very sensitive. Hello? Hey. It just gets emotional. Anytime you watch shit like this. Ashley, um, the last time we spoke, you were telling me about everything you were going through at a rally, a protest rally you were at, and I wasn't sensitive at all. So I just called and said I'm sorry, mainly because I've had my own similar experiences and I reacted completely differently. Yeah, you just gonna come up out of nowhere. I don't even know how to respond. <laughs> I mean, I feel you, I feel you, but I haven't. It's a, it has been on my mind. I, I would call my daughter. You know, I had her when I was 15. 
I know I made a lot of mistakes. Hey, kid. I just want to tell you I'm sorry, baby. What are you sorry for? You're my oldest child. You've had to go through everything with me, and I know it's been a roller coaster. But I love you, and I'm sorry. Honestly, yeah, having to grow up together and everything, because you're only a couple years older than me. I'm dead. I can call my grandma. I lied to her yesterday. About she what? wanted a ride home, but I just didn't want to pick her up and take her home. <laughs> she was a little upset. Yeah. Hey, Nana, I'm just going to apologize and say I'm sorry to you. Because I didn't come get you yesterday and I left you, Auntie uh, Salinas. No, it's okay. I'm just tired. It was cold. I got to ride home. She was freezing. Thank you for apologizing, though. I love you. <laughs> I owe you a ride. Hello? Say, I owe you a ride. I owe you a ride, Nana, so I'll pick you up. <laughs> You're going to call him? My dad. Why? I'm about to get emotional. I don't know if I should be saying sorry or if my dad should be saying sorry, but... We just haven't been clicking. Hello. All right, Dad. I just wanted to call you and let you know that I am sorry. I just feel like we haven't been like connecting or been like on good terms. So. You know, it's just that I'm going through a lot of health issues, and the doctor was trying to tell you about it, and all you said was, "Hope he gets better." That broke my heart. So. And the reason for that is because you needed my help financially and I wasn't able to help you and then it just became a thing. Well, I tell you what, maybe both of us need to say you're sorry to each other and if I put you in some kind of difficulties, I'm sorry for that too. <laughs> All right? Mm -hmm. All right, I love you. I love you too, Dad. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Okay. Yeah, that was needed. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, there's a lot of people I want to say sorry to, uh, well, certain people, and uh, I never got the chance to yet, so one of these days, I know I got to apologize, and um, yeah, the more I think about it, too, the more uh, the more I, I sit on it, I feel more, uh, I feel more bad about it every time I think about it, so I mean, that's why I always put it off, so yeah, I've been thinking about Shit, I fucked up, so I don't know. <clears throat> I think it's a good video, a good tribute at least. For now at least, you know? Like and subscribe.